I got into shark research uh, because when I was a kid I saw the movie Jaws and I was terrified of sharks and the only way that I overcame my fear was to read about sharks and the more I read about them the more fascinated I became and now I've spent my life researching sharks and trying to find ways to learn more about them. The story of the shark really is a sad story in, in, in some ways because many species are endangered. And so if there's something we can learn from the shark, it's really that they have a right to survive, just like anything else. And if we take the time to care, to learn about them, to understand them, uh, we're closer to helping protect them. And when we have a healthy ecosystem with sharks in it, that's a healthy system for us. So ultimately, when we really strive to conserve biodiversity, we're doing it for ourselves. OSEARCH is very unique in its approach to science because it really allows access to white sharks, which is unprecedented. To be able to come out on the lift and to have access to blood samples, to look at visual ecology of the eyes of the animal, to look at their electrosensory capabilities, to tag the animals, these are all things that are not possible on other research vessels. And it's a blend between the expertise of the fishermen and the expertise of the scientists in really unraveling the mysteries of these animals. I have spent a lifetime of trying to answer questions about sharks with the goal of trying to inspire conservation and a deep care for these animals. You know, I hope to inspire the next generation of scientists and, and people who care about what happens to the ocean.